You're a fighter and you don't know what to do with that? F-13 is essential for the every fighter. But vast majority of the people don't know exactly which exercises are the most effective. Through the years of the experience, I found for myself a bundle of the exercises which you cannot find anywhere. Your abs and your core muscles make your body bulletproof. Especially for the people who practicing already for a lot of years and they got bored with the abs exercises, I have something for you. Okay, hear me out. Top 3 super effective but in the same time uncommon movements for your abs and core muscles. For the first two of them necessary to have some equipment, but the third one even without gonna explode your muscles. First exercise. What I need for the first drill? I need just a ball, four, six, even more kilos. If you're a big boy with the powerful abs, you need the bar. You have to be able to hang with the weight. Your hands also working here crazy. Then you're gripping the ball using your both legs. And then using the momentum, I start to raise my legs. One, two, three. In the same time, both legs. I'm squeezing abs. My hips is working here. After the 10 or 12 reps, you're gonna feel your abs, also you're gonna feel your hands entire this line gonna explode. In this exercise, we can find how exactly the lower part of the abs is working. I highly recommend you to use this drill because that's so much complicated. Your entire body is working here and that's not usual or classic crunches with which you cannot surprise your abs muscles anymore. Second exercise. Whew, the next one is not a joke, literally. I need for them such a big dumbbells, but I'm not gonna leave them at all. Nevertheless, trust me, it's not a joke. They're in the same line. I'm putting my hands here on them. Then I have here, start to balance. I have to raise my legs. I'm starting with the extension. Then slowly, I'm bringing them between the one dumbbell, full extension there. Then without touching the floor or without touching any dumbbell, I bring them again to the middle, straighten, holding for a little and go to the other side. Slow work, holding here, and bringing back. If we count each rep, one, two, three, four, I need to sit 10 or 12 in a row, and trust me, your abs, your core muscles, your hips gonna absolutely die. Just pay attention about one thing. In the first motion, you see my hands are working crazy because I have to be able to hang with the weight and also raise my legs. With this one, is also super complicated because I have to maintain my right body position through the such a hard and complicated movement. As I promised you, for the third one, you don't need any extra equipment that you can do it even at home. In the beginning of the session, if you'd like to warm up your shoulders, your obliques, your core and your hips even more, trust me, this one is the game changer. I bet that 80% of the people who's watching this video, they're not able to do this one. All right, you remember the classic plank. I place my both hands here on the floor. Initially, everything seems so easy. I'm raising my leg. I start to bring my knee as close as possible to my triceps. Then I'm straightening in my leg, holding for the few seconds, and then slowly I bring my leg back. I'm continuing with the second leg. I'm raising knee, bringing forward, transferring my weight slightly forward, extending the leg, holding for a little, then slowly bringing back. My guys, try to accomplish 12 reps. Try to do six six in a row without falling, and super important to maintain such a slow, tasty manner of the work. The funny thing about the third movement, you cannot accomplish it if you do not have power and mobility of your hip joint. And also without stretch legs, that's gonna be super hard to do. And ultimately, how often you have to do this routine? Twice per week is enough for the abs. You don't need to practice your abs workouts every day. You will achieve nothing. Twice per week, about 20, even the 30 minutes, it's gonna be enough. If you're a fighter, I do not recommend you to practice classic stuff, especially when you experience guy. Try to go with something interesting something unusual where you cannot find anywhere. Remember, you have to be unique and super multifunctional athlete, but not just a fighter or boxer. You have to be flexible, you have to be powerful, you have to be strong, fast. And I hope this exercise is gonna help you with that. Follow my channel, leave a comment, and send this video to a friend who wants to have powerful abs muscles. And I'll catch you up later.